And the current regime of the show, once known as Doctor Who, continues its pandering, and it just keeps getting funnier. As I said before, I have no investment in Doctor Who going forward. I'm just here to make fun of its current state, and boy do we have a humdinger today. Doctor Who's Jodie Whittaker reveals parents raised her gender neutral before it was even considered a thing. No they didn't, Jodie. Quit talking out of your ass. Remember when Doctor Who was about the, you know, stories, and things that used to be fun. Now it's all about gender and regressive far-left propaganda. The first female Doctor is played by Jodie Whittaker, also known as Doctor Nasty, has discussed her childhood and family life in a new interview, while desperately appealing to the only fan base the BBC wants these days. And, let's be honest, it's the only fan base they have left. Well, until they get bored, saying her parents raised her and her brother gender neutral before it was even considered a thing. As I said, stop talking out of your ass. They sound like cool parents. No, this sounds like bullshit! The star told the Times that this approach to parenting meant she and her siblings were given the same opportunities growing up. So you mean, like all men and women in the West have been for, you know, decades now, they were treated equally. Oh, what a concept! This ain't gender neutral! That's just how things are! My brother and I were raised gender neutral before it was even considered a thing, the 38-year-old told the publication. Yes, article! That's the third time you've mentioned it. That doesn't make it any more true. We were given equal opportunities and thrown into the same activities. Like most kids! Our parents told us that our social skills- SOCIAL SKILLS?! IS THAT A JOKE?! And sports were just as important as our academic results. Like the ideologues that major in bullshit! They wanted me to be well-rounded, able to have a proper conversation, and have an inquisitive mind. You must be joking! Gender-neutral parenting is when parents do not force cues and items stereotypically considered as for boys or for girls on their kids. Actually, this is called letting your kids do what they want. This is not gender neutral. Unfortunately, some of the younger generation were raised a bit too freely. Everybody gets an award, folks. This leads to being triggered at every little thing and other pesky little things like burning down cities. It can also involve allowing a child to choose the clothes they want to wear and the toys they want to play with. You let your kid dress as they want. But considering Jody was a kid in the 80s and early 90s, surely she was aware there were consequences for showing up to school dressed a certain way. It was it wasn't like today, folks. Nobody cared about your feelings. Kids could be cruel. In the past, celebrities such as Pink said they have raised their kids gender neutral. Pink's an idiot! Nobody cares about Pink! Jody became Doctor Who in 2017, the first woman to take the role since its debut in 1963. Yes, the name of the character is Doctor Who. Well, most of them think it is. But then, who cares about getting the name right? The current fan base just wants to know what the Doctor identifies as. That said, she previously explained she isn't playing the role with a defined gender. Well, she isn't really playing the Doctor at all. She's playing a scowling, scrunch-faced, duck-running bag of hatred and political correctness. She told Marie Claire in 2018, I'm playing a Time Lord who's essentially an alien and inhabits different bodies, and this one is female. Nice try, Jody. The best thing for me, though, is that for the first time in my life, I'm not playing a stereotypical woman because as much as I approach everything as an actor, I am continually labeled by the female version of that character. Oh, shut up, Jody! Nobody said that! What we did say is that you're only capable of playing one type of character, mopey and annoying. It's only about gender because people like you chose to make it about gender. And no, you ain't playing a stereotypical woman because normal women don't have a seething hatred of straight white dudes just for being straight white dudes. I recently had someone ask me, are you playing the doctor as a boy or a girl? I replied, I'm just playing it. Keep convincing yourself of that. This is the most freeing role because there are no rules. Um, I guess that means you never read the BBC rule book on diversity and inclusion. Actually, never mind. Those rules don't apply to you because you're special. Those that claim to be discriminated against become the discriminators. Nice try, Jody. This merely makes you look more like a virtue signaling idiot. And that's it for today. Don't forget to subscribe and check your subscription and notification status because YouTube continues to be shady on these things. Follow me on Parlor and troll me on Twitter. And as always, everyone, thanks for watching and have a great day.